Boom. I'm shadow boxing over here again. I don't even shadow box, but it is the good guy. Uh, I know that for sure. Coming at you again with my Tuesday takedown video. I'm outside. Gonna be doing them outside for a while for the time being. I love it. I love it. It's like so much room for for activities, you know, like uh, Step Brothers. Did we just become best friends? Yeah. You can catch me uh, inside later, turning my twin uh, beds into bunk beds, because that's how I roll. <laughs> uh, January 29th, 2019. Uh, coming at you with a just, uh, just pumped up video, you know? Each one of these, each one of these, you know, I look forward to them more. I, I was thinking, ah, maybe I'll uh, let yesterday's video kind of settle and let y'all stir it up and uh, chew it up and put it out to the world a little bit. But I had some great inspiration. So there I was in the streets of Shaolin, came out of the shadows, inspected deck, Ghostface Killer, the Method Man, Raekwon Chef. That's a Wu-Tang reference. Back from uh, in the day when I was a misguided youth on the farm, bumping gangster rap. Thought I was a gangster. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about something I said, uh, and, and and I've referenced this in a couple of my videos. Um, I've said I'm not an expert uh, or professional on, on anything. I'm here to offer my personal experience. And while the latter is true, I had to think about it and say, you know what? I am, in fact, a professional, an expert at something. And not totally from choice or, or like of my own accord, you know, this is just, you know, Aaron slowly growing because of all that, you know, brain trauma, you know, falling off stuff when I was a kid, you know, working with limited brain cells from drinking and drug use. I am in fact, however, a professional mistake maker or a pro mistaker. Maybe you could hashtag that, you know, maybe start a movement. And I, I, I can offer my experience with that, you know? It's like somebody comes up to me, hey, how's it going, what's your name, Aaron? Professional mistake maker? Yeah, own it. And I don't mean that in a, a groveling, self-deprecating way, you know, because it, it's got me to where I am today. Um, those mistakes and, and realizations recently have uh, enabled me and, and, and motivated me to, to step out of that hallway uh, referencing or my, my video from yesterday and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna own that you know if you've realized you've made some mistakes in the past I want to challenge you to don't uh, don't get down on yourself I think I, I, I personally know you know this is for from all my mistakes that you know we we're, we're our world's we're, the, we're our own world we're our own worst critic and and um, that isn't self-serving, you know? We've been there, we've, we've made some mistakes, things that were our own decision, whether we knew it or not, learned behavior, you know, just, just uh, getting in a vicious cycle. Whatever the reason was, you're good. You're not alone in that. Uh, an insight I had, a light that went on, was that I think part of the loneliness, the, the what we feel as, as humans is that we, we, we feel we're alone in, in how we feel, what we're experiencing, and, and that couldn't be farthest from the truth. Uh, you know, I, I, if anything, I, I learned from going to, to meetings uh, back in the day is that we were there to share our experience, strength, and hope. And, and, you know, you go, you hear some stories and you're like, oh, I know that. Oh, yeah, I've been through that, you know? And, and, and all of a sudden, you know, it's, you don't feel so alone. And that's, uh, it's, it, it's powerful, you know? It, it, it's it's a, a weight off of myself to just realize, hey, you know what? Whatever I've done, whatever, wherever I've been, I'm not alone in it. And I'm okay for it. And today, 
if I make mistakes, I'm just gonna own it because you know that's I'm a pro at it. You know, it's got me to where I am, and I can share it with you. I shared a little uh, a, a meme slash quote. Uh, it's it's something I took from Jordan Peterson. Jordan Peterson is a, a psychologist. He's Canadian. Guy's brilliant. Uh, he's got some YouTube stuff. Uh, he's, he's just, I, 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 I would be like starstruck, you know? It's like somebody uh, met Brad Pitt or Angelina Jolie. I want to meet Jordan Peterson because this guy is, uh, he's, he's, he's like the, the, the motivational uh, self-improvement champion of the world. He's not a very big dude either. <clears throat> he's got a book. It's called 12 Rules for Life. Check it out. Uh, I'm just about uh, a couple uh, chapters into it. Rule one is, and I'm saying verbatim, uh, walk with your chest out, shoulders back. I'm telling you, this is a game changer. I'm sure there's some physical benefits. So, you know, I, I haven't done any research, you know, on it. But uh, it definitely, you know, makes you feel physically better. And, and... I don't know, maybe it makes you feel like you're a little bit taller, you know? Gives you a little confidence, uh, even though you might not realize it does. And, and, and I think my experience has been that uh, people will respond to you in, in a more positive way. Uh, respect, um, I don't know, maybe take you more seriously. I mean, that's what I'm trying to do. They look at this guy, they're like, who's this guy? I ain't taking him seriously. That guy's a whole lot of, whole lot of hot mess. But I don't care, because, you know, it's all about the story I tell in my mind, you know. It's all about how I perceive Aaron and how, and, and then walking tall, keeping your head up, shoulders back, chest out. It'll, uh, it'll take you places. All right, that's my ramble. A little quick video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, I hope you've, uh, I've challenged you before to look others in the eye. I made some, uh, some, I wrote down some goals. I'm gonna do that every day. Look somebody in the eye, I'm gonna smile them. Smile at them. I'm, I'm telling you, that's a, a, that's a game changer. I have this theory that if, if people would do that more often, the world we live in would be a much better place. And it makes you feel better about yourself. It makes them feel better about their, themselves. They might think you're weird. You might feel weird about it at first. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm having all kinds of great uh, experiences everywhere I go. Just, just for, you know, look at, looking at somebody, you know? And they don't really know how to respond, you know? First they're like, looking at me. Yeah, we need to change the world. Be kind to yourself. Look somebody in the eye. Smile at them. And don't get down on yourself for mistakes. Be a pro mistaker, a pre professional mistaker, like the good guy. And things, uh, are gonna be good good things will come I guarantee it thanks for tuning in if you're new to the channel welcome if you liked what you heard please like if you hated it give me a thumbs down uh, I'm open to comments feedback things you'd like to hear you know uh, cri criticism you got to be open to that I totally am and we will uh, catch up with you on the next video you take care go get it go take down that Tuesday Peace.